think every costume on this show is incredibly thought about and impressive. It's kind of a free-for-all because it's this alternative world. It's a real pleasure to have all these things designed and made. The clothes you wear determine the way people see you. It was, it's interesting, the style of the show and the sort of period, because it's, it's kind of not set in a particular period. Again, it's, we have that freedom to explore. It sort of could be 40s, but we push the boundaries of that and modernise it slightly. I like it. Blue is quite your colour. That era where you're never without a shirt and a tie. You know, even if you're not wearing a suit, you've got a shirt and a tie. And this might be one of the only times you don't see his shirt and tie. You have to find a logic, and there has to be a logic within Lyra's world. We've dressed people in non-definable clothing. It's trying to mix up things that exist and create a look that you believe, but is timeless. There's different technologies in Lyra's world. They travel by Zeppelin, so there would be certain things, fabrics and technology that would exist in Lyra's world. So then that will influence how people dress. Costumes are really interesting. There's something slightly military to him, even though he's a he's been a theologian and he's been a, and he is a scientist. He's also an adventurer and an explorer, and we've, I think we've reflected that really well. I loved the first costume of all of them, but then I got my beautiful fur coat, which is a bit of a pain when you're doing location and it's boiling hot in September. But it's great for when you're at the studio and it's freezing. Caroline is an incredible designer, and we had good fun actually because the Egyptians are so cool. You'll see when you see all of the extras and everything, we were like, we're so cool. Um, so we do, we have a great old time with our costumes. I think my character looks well cool. This jacket is sick. Look at my ring, it's a hawk. We had to make a costume that would look of the earth, of the forest, like she had just wrapped rags around her, but also be sturdy enough for her to fly, for me to have a harness underneath my costume. I'm here to help. I'm in awe of them. It really, it really helps me as an actor. Yeah, man, I, I have never dressed more badass in my life. I've worn blouses on stage, I've worn guayaberas on stage, uh, but like going cowboy is, is, is very much my aesthetic. I'm very much enjoying it. I've had these most I mean, glorious costumes. I mean, the best thing about this job is that you know that she's going to look good. The shoulder bag. Well, it's perhaps a little old for you. I mean, everything's been made for me as well, so it's, um, it's a real pleasure to have all these things designed and made.